Fish on. Yeah! Go! Dancer. Nick here with Will and Brett. We're gonna float the Kenai today. We're going from Centennial Park down to Eagle Rock. We're using the Spinard drift boat. Sockeyes and some rainbow trout and Nolly Bar. I didn't even realize all these people were right here. Combat fishing at its finest. I don't see anybody with a fish on. Yeah. Well, there's a lot of people here. There always are. I think I'm fouled. You're not fouled? Yeah, I am. That's because you're whipping it back and forth. Can't do that with a ball. Gotcha. It's really easy if you just want to let the ball into the water and I'll slow the boat down and you can let line up. Fish on. Lost it. Well, at least we know they like the color. At least one does. You got shrimp on that one? No, this one's like a peach kind of. So you want to get a little lift and drift action. I think there's been more fish counted on the north side of the river. Correct. There has been. What side's the north side? But it's not to say they haven't fish. switched over no. to the other side already. Right. So it depends on what curve in the river there is. It says water's closed to fishing though. Ten, and then it, in fine print it says within 10 feet of yeah, the Yeah, you just can't anchor your boat on land or anything or step up there. But it's deep. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it is deep. yeah, that's way too deep. Those guys are only standing two feet off and they're waist deep. You want to hold the rods? Yeah. Where's the dock? Right here. Okay, anchors out, just hold us. Stay yep. out. Just nose in right here and we'll get them both out of the way. So what we're doing here is we know the people that own this cabin, so we've stopped here to fish their dock because uh, the fish are running up right along the bank here. So this is a stop on our way down the Kenai. I'm gonna try to lay into a few here and then keep moseying. Oh, missed one. Nope. Right when we first pulled up, yeah, there was fish jumping, right? Yeah. And then he's got work that starts in February on the slope. Fish! Ah, oh, f***. That, that? that was Nick. Surprise, this is a brand new hook. This is one of those octopus hooks. Yeah. Tickle the fin. Ah, yeah. oh, There's another one. I hooked one. Tail. Tail. Good. He spit it off. Caught myself a fillet, guys. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Right in the mouth, too. The hell? Oh, that's somebody's stringer. Oh, that's gross. Yeah, sweet. Thanks. Yeah, thanks, guys. Whoa, he's a dancer. <laughs> you got him. Nicely done. Oh, just missed. One. Dude. <laughs> Nick missed one. What is my deal? I've been out of the loop too long. Forgot how to do it. Yep. Nice. Whoa. Here, I'll get the net. Good lord. I guess I just don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Ooh, close. Lost him. That was another big one, too. I'll get the net.
You got him get hooked good? No, dorsal. That was a dorsal fin. Ah! What is going on with this hook? I think I know what's going on, guys. My yarn is getting in the way of the hook. Yep, and that's the reason why I've missed three. So those are the setup with the size 2-0 hook. You just want a little bit of yarn. You don't want the yarn to touch your hook tip. Otherwise, you'll miss some fish. I learned that the hard way. Now we're floating again and we're, we've switched back over to fishing for trout. And Dolly Varden. What Will's doing here is just trying to keep the Marlin. bobber going down the river without making any ripples. <clears throat> and uh, when it starts making some wake, then he pulls it in close to the boat. So you just want a nice drift on your beads. Uh, we're fishing some salmon eggs, some pink ones right now. I'm gonna cast. Okay. Never mind. Oh, you're down. <clears throat> Statue of Liberty, that thing, Nick. I was, yeah, I was f***ing around. Like always. That was definitely a fish. That was a fish. Yep, snagged. Break off? Oh, saved it. Did I? Well, yeah. Sure those are still pegged. Yeah, they are. Yeah, you're not going to see me foul up my line twice. I learned that lesson. Yeah, you always want that ball to land in yeah. before you cast it in. A lot of seagulls on that roof. Oh, shit. Whoa. Wow. That is a lot of birds taking dumps. Come on, that's a beautiful drift. You're welcome. Casting. Oh, I gotta make sure this is still good. Oh man, my beads are all the way down. Uh oh. Damn you. That's just from that last snag. Oh, fish on. Yeah. Let's go. You need a net? No. Yes! Woohoo! That's a nice truck. Yeah, it is. Is it? Yep. Beauty. Logan. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's a that's a good one. Nice. You need the pliers? Yeah, I do. Oh, uh, they're right behind Brett. Oh. Dude, what the hell? Seriously? Whoa, these yahoos. Holy sh. Alright, here we go. Bring it her up. Cut. Oh Beautiful man, that's fish. a big one. Come on, buddy. Get him? Alright. Alright. First volley of the day. High five. Goes to Will. Woo! Oh man, how'd you like that? Like a pro. Dude, I am a pro. So what I'm trying to do is get a good cast and pull this across. What I'm waiting for is the hook to stop somewhere. Which would indicate that a fish swam up across the line and the line stopped. Like that. And I got a big chunk of filet. Luckily, it's not the whole fish, it's just a small piece. Will's got a fish on. 
He's gonna show us how to land one without a net. Oh, the second run of red started coming up the river and uh, they haven't made it into the upper yet or through Skelac Lake. So everybody's fishing the lower because this is where they are. That might've been one. Dude. Dude, I don't know what my problem is. Keep rowing. Yeah, we're moving. Okay, I'm casting. There we go. Come on, come on. Oh. Oh, yeah. Still He's on. on. Still on, baby. Oh. oh, you horsed him. Dude, I screwed it up. That was not textbook. No. I like this section of river right here. Cause you don't got enough weight on there. <laughs> Slap some more weight on there. Get it down to him. It's down, trust me. Might as well catch one real quick. Okay. <laughs> Might as well. All right, so Brett's gonna do a little drift fishing for some reds. We'll see what happens. This isn't even my rod. <laughs> <laughs> Whose rod is it? It's a TFO. See, now it is my TFO. But no, I should have an eight weight. 